former Ushenyi Shaka Municipality and Western Youth MP Nasa Basajja Balaba appeared at the Police Criminal Intelligence and Investigations Directorate Head Office in Chibuli on behalf of his brother Hassan Basajja Balaba. Police AID had earlier summoned the city businessman to answer to allegations of forgery and uttering false documents. Nasa came along with Hassan Basajja Balaba's lawyer Geoffrey Nangumia and Igara East MP Michael Mawanda. The trio told police CID that Basajja Balaba couldn't report because he was out of the country on a business trip and he is expected back next week. The controversial Kampala businessman is accused of forging a court consent judgment between his other group of companies and the Attorney General so as to evade tax. Basajja's troubles stem from the 142 billion shillings that government paid him as a compensation for city markets. He had bought the markets, but government ordered that they revert to the vendors. Government is also contesting the authenticity of the amount of money. The Director of Public Prosecutions has reportedly located the criminal charges against Basajja Baraba, and he could be produced to court for trial. Under the Penal Code Act, he faces a 10-year jail term if convicted of forging judicial or official documents. He also faces an equivalent jail term for allegedly uttering false documents. Meanwhile, popular musician Joseph Mayanja, commonly known as Jose Chameleon, has been questioned by CID detectives in Chibuli over the death of a 27-year-old man who allegedly burnt himself from his home. The musician, who is a suspect in the death, appeared briefly in the afternoon at the CID offices. The late Robert Karamaji reportedly entered Chameleon's home in Seguku, a Kampala suburb, under unclear circumstances. He is said to have had an exchange with Chameleon's wife, Daniela Tim, before setting himself ablaze. He later succumbed to the burns at Mulago Hospital, where he had been taken for treatment. But there are reports that Karamaji was set ablaze by Chameleon and his boys. Salman Amwanje. NBS Television.